Prepare yourself for today's class. Prepare your mind, your body and your breath. Bring that intention in yourself for learning. Join your both hands together in front of your heart center. We'll start with the opening mantra. Shri Gurubhyo Namaha Vande Gurunam Charanaravinde Sandarv Shita Swatma Sukha Bhavote Nishreya Shri Jangali Kayamane Sansar Hala Halmo Hashante Abahu Purishakaram Sank Chakra Siddharanam Sahastra Sirsham Shvetam Pranamami Patanjalim Om Atha Yoga Anushashinam Gently bow down your head towards God and ask God to give us strength and energy for today's class. Rub your both palms, apply it on your eyes, on your face, on your whole body, while blinking, open your eyes. Om Shanti. Sit in any comfortable position on your mat. Now raise your both arms up over your head. Stretch your both arms, elevate your hands towards the ceiling and feel that gentle stretch on your spine. As you exhale, drop your right hand on the right side and take your left arm over your head. Look towards your left hand and keep feeling, keep sinking down on the right side. Inhale again, come back to the center. Exhale, left side. Drop your left palm, take your right hand over your head and feel the stretch on your side oblique. Inhale again back to the center. Now exhale, just drop your right hand on the floor. And with your left hand, stretch your neck towards the left side. Move your head front and back a little bit. And feel that stretch which is coming from your neck. The gentle stretch. Do not move it very fast. Just do it very slow and be gentle with your neck. Okay, inhale. Both hands up and neck back to the center. Exhale, drop your left hand down. Now just bend your neck towards the right side. Again, move your neck front and back, front and back. Inhale again, arms up, exhale, drop your right hand out of your left knee, place your left arm behind your back for the twist, bring your both shoulders in one line, open your chest and with every exhalation bend towards the back, feel that twist, inhale again back to the center. As you exhale, drop your left hand out of your right knee. Keep looking back towards your right shoulder. Open your chest and bring your shoulders in one line. Inhale again back to the center. And then exhale, drop your hands down. Now open your knees a little bit out and try to come into Shashankasan. Stretch your both hands front. Keep sinking down with your chest and drop your chin on the floor or on your mat. Now from here, bring your hands in front of your chest and sweep yourself up for the tabletop. Prepare yourself for the upcoming class. Inhale, look up, roll your shoulder, open your chest here, tuck your tailbone out. Exhale, look down, make a hump on your back. Inhale again, look up. As you exhale, try to look down. Inhale again, lift your chest up. 
open your chest here and hold there just keep breathing squeeze your scapula roll your shoulders exhale make a hump on your back tuck your tailbone in protract your shoulder blades and elevate with your hands okay come back to the center now stretch your right hand back in front stretch your right hand front sorry and then drop your right hand down yeah keep sinking down with your shoulder and feel the flexion of the shoulder in your right hand look up towards your left shoulder towards the ceiling and feel that gentle stretch which is coming from your shoulder keep breathing stay there inhale again up and then exhale drop your right palm back on the mat now change your hand now lift your left arm up and then exhale drop your left out arch of your palm on the mat and push you with your thoracic down and just feel that stretch which is coming from your shoulder again hold there keep sinking down with your chest inhale again front and then exhale drop your left palm back on the mat now from here lift your right leg up and then grab your right ankle with your left hand try to maintain your balance on your left knee and your right palm lift your chest up look up for the half bow pose keep breathing extend your left shoulder and then slowly release your leg and drop your left palm down and your right knee down now lift your left leg up reach your left leg high and then try to grab your left ankle with your right hand rotate your shoulder inside and then open your chest and lift your leg up for the half bow pose feel the stretch in your erectus muscles of your back leg keep lifting your chest and your leg up slowly release your leg down your palm down now from here tuck your toes reach your hip side towards the ceiling and then come for the downward facing dog on your mat keep your knees bent for starting and then pedal your legs here one by one but keep pressing your palms on the mat properly and elevate with your spine towards the ceiling now bring your right leg front between your both palms drop your knee down left knee down and lift your chest up for aswasanchalana horse riding pose keep sinking with your hips down as you exhale bring your left leg front to meet your right leg into padhastasan inhale raise your both arms up and come up as you exhale come back to samasthiti open your legs shoulder width apart for kati chakrasana Okay, prepare yourself for sun salutation. A both legs together, feet together. Take one feet distance from a mat. A come inhale, raise your both arms over your head, stretch your both arms, look up towards the ceiling, tell tuck your tailbone in and reach your body high. Do exhale, bend forward down towards your leg with your hip joint and drop your both palms beside of your feet. inhale look front lengthen your spine here into half a look up as you exhale press your palm and step back or jump back into chaturanga inhale roll your shoulders look up open your chest here for upward facing dog exhale roll back to the downward facing dog 
stay there for five counts. One, two, keep paddling your legs, three, four, deep breath in, deep breath out, and five. Now bend your both knees, jump front into halfway, look up, inhale. As you exhale, bend fully forward down. Take your time in inhalation and exhalation. Inhale all the way, come up high. Exhale, Samastiti. Second round. A come in, hand again, raise your both arms up, reach your hands up. Do a exhale, bend for the forward fold. Ready, inhale, look front here. Chatwari, as you exhale, take your legs back to Chaturanga Dandasana. Pancha, inhale, roll yourself up into upward facing dog. Exhale, roll down into downward facing dog. Hold there again, catch your breath. One, keep breathing. Two, three, four, and five. Now bend your both knees, jump front into halfway look up. As you exhale, bend fully forward down. Inhale, all the way come up. Exhale, Samastati. Sun salutation B, first round. You come inhale, bend your knees and reach your arms high for the chair pose Utkatasan. So exhale, bend for the forward fold Uttanasan. 3D inhale, look front, lengthen your spine here. Chatwari, take your legs back to Chaturanga Dandasana. Pancha inhale, upward facing dog. Shut, exhale, downward facing dog. Sapta, lift your right leg up and then bring your right leg front for warrior A. Ashto, exhale, take your leg back to Chaturanga. Nava, inhale, Udmukha. Dasha, exhale, Adomukha. Eka Dasha, bring your left leg front for warrior A. Bring your left leg into 90 degree. Back feet 5 degrees in. Press the out arch of your right feet. Do not lift your feet off from the floor. Exhale, drop your hands down and take your left leg back to Chaturanga. Inhale, Urdhumukha. Exhale, Adomukha. Stay there. One, deep breath in, deep breath out. Two, Three, four, and five. Now bend your both knees, jump front into halfway look up. As you exhale, bend fully forward down. Inhale, all the way come up for the chair pose. Exhale, release back to Samastati. Second round, inhale, reach your arms high over your head for the chair pose. So exhale, bend towards your leg for the forward fold. Trini, inhale, look front. Chatwari, take your legs back to Chaturanga. Pancha, inhale, Udmukha. Shut, exhale, Adomukha. Sapta, right leg front again. We'll make warrior A from our right leg. Exhale, drop your hands down for Chaturanga. Inhale, Udmukha. As you exhale, Adomukha. Now bring your left leg front for warrior A. 
Exhale, drop your hands down and take your left leg back to Chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. As you exhale, downward facing dog. Paddle your legs here. Catch your breath and prepare yourself for the upcoming posture, Marichyasana. Take deep breath in and out. So we'll start with the Marichyasana A. Look front, bend your knees and jump front into Dandasana. Straight your legs. Then bend your right leg at the knee. And then grab your right leg with your right hand. Exhale, bend down. Grab your right leg with your right hand, very nice, and grab your interlock your fingers, or you can grab your wrist as well, wherever you can reach. Hmm. Inhale, lift your chest up, open your chest, and with exhale, try to bend down towards your left leg. Hold there for five counts one, two, three, four. And five, inhale, again lift your chest up. Exhale, drop your hands down. Inhale, lift yourself up. And take your legs back to Chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Again, bend your both legs and jump front for Marichyasana A from your left leg. Bend your left leg at the knee. Now grab your left leg with your left hand. Rotate your shoulder inside and then grab your right wrist behind your back. Inhale again, halfway look up. As we exhale, bend down towards your right leg. Hold for five counts. One, keep breathing in and out. Two, three, four and five inhale again come up exhale drop your hands on the floor inhale lift yourself up and take your legs back to chaturanga inhale udmukha exhale adomukha now we'll go for marichyasana b jump front again sit into dandasana Make the position for Marichyasana B. Bend your left leg at the knee and drop your left ankle or your left feet on your right top of the thigh. Then bend your right leg at the knee and then grab your right leg with your right hand and again interlock your fingers. Inhale, lift your chest up and then exhale. Try to touch your head on your knee or on the floor, wherever you can reach. Hold for five counts. One, two, three, four, and five. Inhale, come up straight. Exhale, release your hand and release your leg. Again, lift yourself up. Take your legs back to Chaturanga. Inhale, Udmukha. Exhale, Adomukha. Now bend your both legs again and jump front. We'll do Marichyasana B from our another leg. So bend your right leg and drop your right leg, right feet on your left top of the thigh. And then bend your left leg at the knee. Now grab your left leg with your left hand. Properly rotate. And then grab your fingers. Inhale, lift your chest up. And then exhale down. Hold there for five counts. Catch your breath. One. Keep relaxing here. Ujjayi breathing. Two. Do not forget to breathe. Three. Four. And five. Inhale. Come back up. Exhale. Drop your hands on the floor. Open your legs. And then inhale, lift yourself up and then take your legs back to Chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. 
as you exhale downward facing dog try to catch your breath here take few seconds to gain your energy back now we'll, now we'll go forward for the next marichya asana third variation bend your right leg and then inhale lift your left arm up and place your right arm behind your back as you exhale just try to drop your elbow or you can grab your right leg with your left hand if you can and hold there for five counts one keep looking back keep breathing two three four and five inhale look front release your hand exhale drop your hands on the floor inhale lift yourself up and then exhale take your legs back to chaturanga dandasana inhale upward facing dog exhale downward facing dog bend your both legs at the knee again jump front into dandasana now bend your left leg at the knee inhale raise your right arm up place your left arm behind your back and then exhale drop your right elbow or your right armpit out of your left knee grab your fingers interlock your fingers and keep elevating your spine towards the ceiling keep looking back towards the left shoulder now one two three four and five inhale look front exhale drop your hands on the floor inhale lift yourself up and then exhale take your legs back to chaturanga inhale ujjumukha exhale atomukha catch your breath here and then again bend your legs come into dandasana now do not uh, see this is the advanced one so you can you know skip that putting your leg on the your you know feet on your thigh so you can bend your right leg first and then drop your left feet under your right leg yeah we can try this variation of this marichasana d because the fourth one is the advanced one we can we will not able to perform it so it's difficult and it's not good to like do the advanced posture when our basic is not clear so inhale lift your left arm up and place your right arm back and then exhale drop your left elbow out of your right knee rotate your shoulder and try to interlock your fingers behind your back so this is the modification for marichasana d who cannot perform the original marichasana d they can perform this modification keep twisting and hold there for five counts 1 2 3 four and five inhale again look front exhale release your hand inhale lift up and then take your legs back to chaturanga inhale upward facing dog exhale downward facing dog bend your both legs and again jump front into dandasana drop your hip down straight your legs now bend your left leg and then take your right leg under your left leg yes it inhale raise your right leg up right hand up sorry and place your left arm back exhale drop your right elbow or your right armpit out of your left knee and then interlace your fingers and hold there look back 1 2 3 4 and 5 inhale look front release your hand release your leg shake your leg 
and then inhale, lift yourself up and take your legs back to Chaturanga. Inhale, Udhmukha. Exhale, Adhamukha. Now relax into child pose. Catch your breath. Relax your body, your mind, and your breath. Now from here, jump forward into halfway look up. Exhale, completely bend down. Inhale, sweep your arms again over the head. And then exhale again, bend forward, put your hands down and relax. Inhale, halfway look up. Exhale, jump back to Chaturanga Dandasana. Inhale, Urdhu Mukha Shwanasana. Exhale, Adho Mukha Shwanasana. Bring your right leg forward for the warrior A. Arms up, hips square. Front your, bend your front leg at the knee into 90 degree angle. Keep sinking your hips down. And then exhale, put your hands on the floor and step back to Chaturanga. Inhale, Urdhva Mukha Shwanasana. Exhale, Adho Mukha Shwanasana. Bring your left leg forward in between your both hands. Arms up over the head, stretch upward. And then exhale again, put your hands down, step back to Chaturanga. Inhale, Urdhva Mukha Shwanasana. Exhale, Adho Mukha Shwanasana. Breathe in, breathe out there. One, two, three, four, and five. Now bring your right leg forward for the warrior A. Arms up over the head, hips square. Now open your hands out for the warrior B. Take your back leg more back. Sink your hips down, look front to your palm. Now from here we will do side angle pose. Drop your right hand beside your right palm, right foot. Reach your left hand up over the ear, stretch. Look at your palm, open up your chest, rotate your shoulders backward. Now from here, press your right hand on the floor, send your right leg back for side plank. Now send your right leg back for the side plank on your right arm. And stay there again for three, two, and one. Now left hand on the floor. Now we'll increase the pace. Yeah, full plank. We'll increase the pace of the movement. Drop your knees, chest and chin down on your mat. Inhale, swing yourself forward for the cobra pose, Bhujangasana. Exhale, roll back on your toes for the Adho Mukha Shwanasana. Bring your left leg forward in between your both hands, arms up for the warrior A. Now open your hands out for the warrior B. Look at your left palm, hands straight in one line. Go far forward towards your left hand and drop your left palm beside your left foot. Right arm up over the ear. Stretch. Keep sinking your hips down. Reach up, now press your left hand on the floor, try to send your left leg back for the side plank on your left side. Hold there, one, just be engaged from your body, two, three, four, and five. Now release your right hand on the floor. Drop your knees, chest chin on the floor once again. Inhale, swing yourself forward for the cobra pose. Exhale, roll back on your toes for Adho Mukha Shwanasana, downward facing dog. 
keep pushing your shoulders keep pushing your head towards the floor breathe in breathe out there now press your palms jump outside of your hands into the yogic squat make sure your feet are turned out your hands are in front of your chest keep on opening your chest high keep pressing your elbows against your knees look front now from here extend your right hand to the right side and then take your left hand up over the ear stretch to the left side slight twisting is coming here on your right side of the waist inhale again come back to the center and then exhale take your left hand out sweep your right arm up over the ear stretch upward look at your palm fix your gaze and push your right knee away from the body one keep on pushing away two three four and five inhale again come back to the center now press your palms try to swing forward into the crow pose flatten your palms in front find the balance on your elbows try to hold there one if you cannot hold there you can lift your one leg on the you can lift your one leg off the floor and other leg on your mat okay two three good job keep trying four and five now release your knees release your feet on the floor get back to the yogi squats now from here once again press your palms swing yourself forward into the crow pose reach your hips high and then exhale again sit back into the yogi squat and then exhale again press your palms on your mat swing yourself forward reach your hips up and then exhale again sit back into the yogi squat keep on moving let's try it for the five times one two three four Keep on moving. Five. Now for the last time, swing yourself forward and try to hold there. One, two, three, four, five, and jump back to Chaturanga Dandasana. Inhale, Urdhum Kashwanasana. And then exhale, Adho Mukha Shwanasana, Downward Facing Dog. Push your shoulders, push your head towards the floor. Ensure that you don't rotate your hands inward. Keep on stretching, keep on pressing. Try to hold there. One, two, three. Now from here we will try to get to the warrior C. Okay, now jump up and bring your right leg forward in between your both hands and then take your left leg up in the air. One, two, three, four, and five again press your palms on your mat and try to jump back to chaturanga inhale urd mukashwanasana exhale adho mukashwanasana keep pushing your shoulders down now let's try to jump forward with the left leg with the left leg jump forward Take your right leg back up in the air and try to hold into warrior C. One, you can take the support of your arms, reach your leg up. Two, three, four, and five. Now flatten your palms. Try to jump back to Chaturanga. Inhale, Urdhva Mukha Shwanasana. Exhale, Adho Mukha Shwanasana. Again, keep pushing your shoulders, keep pushing your head. 
breathe in breathe out normally now from here make a wave out of your body into the plank now swing forward into the plank and then upward facing dog and then downward facing dog now again try to make a wave out of your body swing forward up dog and then exhale down dog again swing forward up dog and then down dog again swing forward for the last time up dog and hold there one two leg straight three four five and then exhale again tuck your toes under roll back on the downward facing dog press your shoulders press your heels down breathe in breathe out there one two three four and five now jump through your hands into dandasana cross your legs you can step your one leg and other leg and swing forward to dandasana as well now we'll try to get into paschimottanasana stretch your both hands up over the head exhale bend forward grab your big toes inhale look up high exhale bend your elbows try to lower your head down on the, on your feet one two three four and five inhale again halfway look up now grab your all toes with your both hands inhale again look front and then exhale bend completely down stretch and hold one two keep bending down three four and five inhale come up high stretch your arms over the head and then exhale release your hands down now we'll do reverse tabletop okay as a counter pose bend your knees no need to straighten your legs press your palms reach your hips up reach high as high as possible lower your head down breathe in breathe out there exhale release your hips back now extend your both legs up grab your big toes open your legs out you yeah, straighten your both legs up reach high find the balance hold one two three four five six seven and then exhale slowly gently release your legs on your mat and lie down on your back now we will twist our spine bend your right leg and place your right foot beside your left left hip and then put your left hand on your right knee now twist your spine backward look at your right palm and hold there one two three four and five inhale again come back exhale switch on the other side bend your left leg put your left leg on your put your right arm on your left knee twist your spine backward and hold one two three four and five now release your legs forward and lie down into shavasana turn your palms up feet turned out relax your spine relax your breath take a deep breath in deep breath out inhale and then exhale
Breathe in, breathe out there. Now bring the awareness back to your body. Move your toes, move your fingers. Extend your both arms over the head. Interlock your fingers and then turn your palms up. Reach high. Bend your left leg at the knee. Now turn on your right side. Now press your palms, sit in any comfortable pose that you like. Eyes remain closed. Now make Gyan Mudra or Chin Mudra with your hands. Spine is straight. Now we will chant one Om followed by three Shanti to finish our class. Inhale. Shanti, Shanti, Shanti. Bring your palms together in front of your heart center. Rub your hands. Place your palms on your closed eyes. Now one more time, rub your hands together. Place your palms on your closed eyes. Feel the warmness on your hands, on your eyes. Bring your hands together again in front of your heart center. Bow your head down. Honor yourself. Honor your practice. Open your eyes while blinking. And namaste to everyone.